Welcome to the third fall of Tale Two Towns. This is the penultimate part. Next week, we will be closing out the LP. But in the meantime, we got one more cart from the Oracle. It's not nearly as cool as the UFO, but it is kind of cute, at least. Is it an alpaca? I wish. Oh, it would have been great. The game is bugged here. It says we got the UFO again. Mecha Packa! <laughs> I literally don't need to do anything. Now, this is the dragon card. We already got that. It's not what the Oracle gave us. <laughs> It's goofy. It's either awful or amazing. I can't decide which. <laughs> it's about up there with the chicken. And it, that is, oh my god, you're Santa. Yep. That's the sled. It's pretty cute. You're Santa. <laughs> oh my god. I think that's what the Oracle gave us. It's a box. <laughs> Delivery box! But I think it has an alpaca on the side. I'm satisfied. <laughs> but my go-to will always be the UFO. Let's go abduct the neighbor's cows. I know we can only use the bath once a day. I wonder if we can use the restroom more than once, because we only get back a little sliver of health. It'd be kind of pointless if you could only do it once. That was a huge apple. Yeah. <laughs> and grapes do not grow on trees like that. No. I instantly dried them in the bread. <laughs> We did at one point, when we lived in our old house, we had a sort of pergola in the backyard and we grew grapes on that. My dad used to make his own wine out of the grapes. Huh. Gotta have a baked apple. Or stewed apple. I don't know why you'd stew it in a bunch of butter, that's not healthy. <laughs> Take something healthy and make it artery clogging. <laughs> This baby comes out fast. None of the whole eight hours in labor stuff. I like that Cam turns into the nervous expecting father. Aw. What a dweeb. Aw, oh, he's pacing. <laughs> It'd be a hell of a twist if you died in childbirth. <laughs> Hot! <laughs> I mean, Harvest Moon Game Boy Color 3 ended if you were played the girl and you got married. Oh, wow. I gave birth to a literal bean. <laughs> See what you've done? <laughs> this is your fault. I should not be standing up right now. <laughs> Yeah, you, what the heck? You should be in bed. <laughs> Name it, Bean. Cam gives a bunch of suggestions. How about no? <laughs> <laughs> Jet, do 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 do. How about vase? So you can keep cycling through his suggestions. Eventually he'll just be like, okay, fine, you name him. <laughs> just shoot him down completely. Jet again? I already said no. I did ask the thread why I should name the baby. Oh god. The suggestion I like the most. Hambogular. It's a secret because I forgot that this part had the bottom screen, <laughs> is Samson. 
strangely normal. Yeah. You should have named it Bean. <laughs> By which I mean we're gonna leave you in bed all the time. That's where the baby stays all the time. Just right there in the middle. <laughs> Shouldn't it have a crib? It has its own pillow. One of you rolls over on top of the baby and you're no longer parents. Well then, we were great parents most of the time. <laughs> wow. This is why Olivia and I are never having children. <laughs> Among other reasons. I was the one who said it should be in a crib. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I can barely take care of myself. I'm never going to take care of a child. <laughs> this is great. So we're having another music festival, this time in Konohana. Who's looking after your child? Who cares? <laughs> He's just lying in bed. It's not going anywhere. He doesn't roll over. He just sits there, moving his face up and down his head. <laughs> so it's the same case as last time. He plays a nice bit of music from a previous Harvest Moon game, but once again, there's only a piano. Yeah. Someone yells from the crowd, Who are you? Look at Mikhail, he's trying so hard. But getting nowhere. I think the lady might have passed out. <laughs> She's just an unmoving blob off to the side. You just hear one note played over and over again. <laughs> Doctor goes up, checks her pulse. Yeah, no. <laughs> it just plays a note every time the drool comes out of her mouth. Dink. Becomes a beautiful symphony. Dink. <laughs> a symphony of drool. <laughs> a few people in the thread, and I think the comments pointed out the last time we did the music festival, it played a song from Fall. I thought it was from Winter. Uh... And it was from Harvest Moon DS. I don't know what song we play today, so if anyone in the comments or the thread knows, feel free to let us know. It's from Harvest Moon Dio. Tale of One Hero. <laughs> Saving the world by kicking one dog at a time. Okay, if you look down in the gold, you'll notice me not giving a shit. <laughs> Ooh, nice. Look at all that. He's basically giving me all of that. I don't even need to give him the watering can. <laughs> Hopefully it's a bit more magical. So he's not actually asking to upgrade his watering can. He needs help to upgrade his own skills so that he can continue to upgrade the watering can. <laughs> because, yeah. Increasing his skills means punching his oven. <laughs> you gotta punch the flame! And that. Whatever that was. Is that the Harvest Moon talking to him? <laughs> Saying he's, like, the idol of the forge or something. Hooray. And just because of that, he's gonna give me a shit ton of tea. Uh, oh my god. Something bugs out, though. It thinks that I'm declining all the rewards. 
Even though he has nothing left to give me. What the f- <laughs> Okay. Now I'm worried. Because I think this means if I decline it, I'm not going to get the items. Maybe he gave me something invisible. Do you still get them, though? I checked. Yeah, I still got them. I don't know what happened there. Huh. If I'm right, I think Sencha tea is, like, really concentrated powdered tea, and you just whisk it up and it's, like, really strong. I don't know. I've never had it, but I think that's what it is. Or that might be Machi. I might be completely wrong. <laughs> the point is, you never had it. Yeah. Please don't hurt me. <laughs> I think an apple that big could make a jar of jam or juice on its own. Yeah. Or two. It's the moon viewing festival, which means we all go to the top of the mountain and look at the moon and go, yep, there it is. <laughs> I have never noticed the moon before. Though the other night it was kind of weird, the moon looked extra huge. And it was like, orange. It was weird. The players are admiring the moon, but you don't get to. <laughs> Characters, rather. Okay, we get it, you like plants. Are there plants on the moon? I don't care if there's not horses on the moon. <laughs> I'm gonna jump there myself. <laughs> oh my god. He just like starts spinning in place and then just sort of hovers up into the sky. <laughs> and then like 10 minutes later he comes back down. It wasn't great. <laughs> Why is Kana a bachelor if he'll never love us as much as he loves this horse? <laughs> that just has creepy connotations, well done. <laughs> I know you do get to look at the moon, never mind. Yeah. You have to earn it. The festival isn't about the moon, necessarily. It's about increasing your friendship with everyone. Personal game. Yep, that sure is a moon. Jumps right on the baby. Yep. You can't interact with the baby at this point. You just need to wait for it to become a toddler, which happens relatively fast. But until that... He's just gonna be sitting there. Well, as much as you can interact with actual babies, they don't do a whole lot. Yeah. And fall, I think that's the final normal crop, green pepper. <laughs> Literally useless. <laughs> Is that why you threw it away? <laughs> Garbage. You make me laugh. <laughs> Thinking about it, I think watermelons from summer are used in recipes, they're just not necessary for any. Ah. I read that as the best corpse of all. What, the... what have you been planting in that field, Dio? <laughs> the other entries were fine, yeah. Yeah, they, they were okay. Give me something decent this time. Still basically the same. <laughs> oh look, it's the angel from Evangelion. Fluorite. 
Which I keep thinking of as fluoride. <laughs> Just fucking throw it away. Throw it back at the town hall in protest. <laughs> I don't need you. I don't need your fluoride. You say my teeth are yellow? God! <laughs> Deal, that's a completely different thing. I still don't like you. <laughs> Out of spite, tries to brush his teeth with the rock. <laughs> Try to feed it to your baby. Open up, it's good for you. Oh my god. Kev's just like, honey, no, stop. You gotta start with flowers first. <laughs> Starts feeding it like nightshade. Honey, you can't eat solid food yet. Oh, silly me, grinds up the flour. <laughs> and any bees that were on the flour. So he just went outside and liquefied the first flour he saw. <laughs> with his mind. With his mind. <laughs> I think we married into a world of Cthulhu's. <laughs> Perfect. We'll fit right in. Next time, it's the final video of the LP. Like I mentioned, I just found a point to say, this is good enough, this is a good point to call the LP, so that if anyone wanted to play the game themselves, they would have the overall idea of how the game is. And also, things went wrong, so... <laughs> oh boy. Look forward to that. Next week, we close out Tale of Two Towns. <laughs> the end times are nigh. <laughs>